I'll be showing you step by step how to change both the icon and the text of Shopify's refresh theme for your store. So in terms of the end goal here, I'm be changing the favicon or the icon as well as its text here. So let me show you step by step. So we'll start on the Shopify dashboard. And from there, you want to go to the left hand side and we'll go to online store. Now, first, we're going to change the text. So we'll go down to the bottom under preferences and to change the text of the tab is going to be under title and meta description. So I'm going to change this here instead of camping Mart, I'll change this to refresh superstore. And I'll just copy and paste this in the meta description. This is how it's going to show up in search engines, but it's also going to change the title of our tab. I'll hit save in the top here. So that's the first step. If I go and reload this tab, I can now see my text has been updated to refresh superstore. So for our next step, let's go and change the favicon or the icon. So we'll go onto online store, we'll click on themes. And from there, I can see the refresh theme is currently installed as my current theme. And I want to go to customize. And this is going to open up the theme settings for a Shopify store. So there's quite a few options here. But what we want to pay attention to is on the left hand side menu under theme settings, it should be a gear icon. We're going to click on that, then we'll get our overall theme settings. And the section we want to pay attention to is called logo. So I'm going to expand that by clicking on it. So we can see our logo, we can select our image. And underneath that, we'll see what's called favicon image. And this is going to change the icon in our tab. What I'm going to do is click select image. And from there, it's going to open up my image library. Now you can add a new image here or drag and drop a new image. But what I'm going to do is select an existing image I've already uploaded. It's going to be the logo for this channel. I'm going to select that, then go to the bottom right and click done. So now I've uploaded my favicon image. I now want to go to the top right hand side and click on save. It's going to save my currently uploaded settings. So if I now navigate to that existing tab I had open, let's go and refresh this page. I can now see my favicon or icon has been updated as well as the text which I previously updated under navigation. Before I go, I want to say that if you generated any sales on your Shopify store, you know how hard it is to keep track of your profit. That's where our sponsor Profit Calc comes in. It's the one click profit calculator available for your Shopify store. All you have to do is select the date range you're looking for to get real time calculations, including a ton of different details, metrics and analytics so you can make smarter decisions for your store. It's going to sync seamlessly with Shopify as well as just about every major ad platform from Facebook, Google, Snapchat, Bing, Pinterest and TikTok. It also has many cost of goods sold integrations and you can find it in the Shopify app store by searching profit calc and looking for this logo in the top left. There's also a link in the description below and from there you can get access to a 15 day free trial so you can test drive everything for yourself and get a true understanding of your store's performance. So just like that we've uploaded the icon and text for our Shopify refresh team. Hopefully this was an easy process for you. If you enjoyed the video I would love it so much if you like and subscribe below. If you have any questions, leave a comment, but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.